channel, please know that you are supporting an autism family, mine, and for that, I thank you. This is an any sign reading. This is an all if the title brought you in here, more than likely there's a message here for you. Please know this is a general reading, so not everything is going to resonate, but something will. Everything happens for a reason. Please leave what doesn't resonate with you for another view. Okay, so I can be picking up on energy from the past, present, or future. Energy is fluid. So I could be picking up on somebody that you're watching this reading for or anybody that's been heavily in your energy or on your mind, all right? So keep that in mind. That being said, this is a love channel. However, whatever spirit wants to uh, talk about is what we're gonna be talking about, baby. Let's go ahead and invite our spirit guides, mine as well as your own, that's angels, galactic council, past loved ones, ancestors, source, God, the almighty, the most high, the creator of all things. That's right, Jesus Christ and whew, Holy Spirit. We got a first card already, folks, and it's the hermit in reverse. Let's see what else we got. We got the two of wands. So what I'm feeling here right off the bat is because somebody is refusing to look within, re uh, refusing to stop for God, um, just not listening to the signs and synchronicities, not listening to the intuition, not going within, not doing the work, essentially, the work is being done over, under, through, and around you is what I'm getting. You will be used by God one way or another, whether you participate or not is how the energy is going to flow so that God could use you either way for the greater good so that light can bear. <sighs> all right, so let's go ahead and clarify. So this is all about refusing. Someone is refusing to step up to their purpose. Someone is refusing to step up. And what I'm getting here is a particular situation. Maybe also true for generalities, but I'm definitely getting that there's a specific situation here that someone is refusing to look at that is stopping altogether and not wanting to um, not wanting to step up to this um, mission, if you will. Um, this definitely has to do with uh, an individual, you or someone in your energetic uh, circle. But this is this situation is 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 going to affect many many people that are in connection with you or this person. Let's go ahead and clarify the hermit card, please, for my collective watching at this time. Again, thank you. Make sure that you like the video, subscribe, or share with someone that you think might resonate with this. Okay. I feel like some the person that I'm speaking of here is noticing things, are recognizing the messages that they're getting from their guides. They are aware of these things. This person might be getting dreams of water, but there's definitely um, blue energy around this person. This person is trying to free themselves from a situation. I always get that. Like somebody is asking for help. Spirit guides, ancestors, God reveals a solution, an answer. The solution and answer is not what they want to hear. Therefore, they ignore it and get nowhere and hide. Not even wanting to think about it. Somebody here is noticing that whatever that they're doing in their 3D life, home, family, work, relationships, what have you, it always seems like there's a puzzle missing. That there's just one, you're so fucking close to making this situation complete, whole, have it come into fruition. You're almost there wrapping things up and yet it does not get done. And therefore, what you are expecting in abundance 
as a blessing, as something that you might feel like you deserve, that you're working hard for, you're not getting. You're not getting. What is it that this person needs to see in order to move forward? Break your silence. Break your silence is going to be the title of this reading. This is the uh, this is the message here. Someone knows that they need to break their silence. Someone is keeping a lot of hidden energy, hidden information hidden emotions to themselves. How is God working in this person's life? Wow. God might be keeping friends and family away. You might be feeling isolated at this time. You might be going through some really tough times so that you are forced into this hermit energy so that you are forced to be alone, forced to feel desperate and only rely on the prayers um, to God. God wants you to speak up. God wants you to speak up to the creator, but also in general. We'll get back to that. How is God working in this person's life? The possibilities that you had before seem to not be there any longer. God is really trying to get uh, somebody's attention here. Someone's saying, you know, stop being the rebel. Stop being the fucking rebel. There's more to it, is what I'm hearing. There's more to it. The lovers at the bottom of the deck. Someone might be pushing away the possibility of coming back together with a soulmate. Page of Cups in reverse, as I say that. And the strength card in reverse. So, I do feel like this energy is really getting to somebody here. They are feeling the loneliness, they are feeling the nothingness. but straight up break the silence is the fucking question and the fucking answer. What are you supposed to be breaking the silence about? The emperor in reverse. So there's someone that was having some narcissistic um, traits Maybe admitting to somebody that they were wrong. Maybe admitting to someone that they made the wrong decisions. Maybe speaking up on some half-truths. But somebody moved recklessly for their own, for their own um, selfish needs and wants and did not consider anybody that it would affect later on down the line, which is why they are now being sat down, put down into a spot where they feel empty. And it's because there's silence where there needs to be noise. There needs to be noise. And in breaking the silence, Someone thinks they're being a rebel by keeping this situation under their hat. It has to do with love with this lover's card. Give me more on the lover's card, please, Spirit. Could be dealing with an Aries, um, a Virgo, a, Lib a Lib Leo. Um, we have the Two of Cups, a Gemini. Something's not done. There's abundance being held back here because somebody is not, is being hard-headed. 
really they're scared to step up really they want to offer uh, a cup of love really they're feeling lonely they're feeling alone they're feeling left out in the cold but what they don't realize is the possibilities are there the learning curve here is breaking the silence breaking the silence of a situation that was handled completely recklessly without thought and carelessly that didn't do anybody involved good even the people that fought and thought that they had won a victory they lost also on the two of cups we have the ace of pentacles so there is a lot of respect and love and appreciation that is being held back from somebody Okay, maybe ideas of where this connection could go. But someone is thinking very heavily about a connection that they see now that was brought to them by God. But they're being very quiet about it. They're not fighting for this connection. And God says, you know what? If you want to see the abundance that you say that you want, break the silence. That's it. Break the silence. That's been your read. Thank you for joining me today. Peace. Namaste.